It is time now for Ask the Expert. Today we're talking about ways to cure your dog's fear of thunder. Joining us live this afternoon, Dr. Katie Heinrich from the Silver Spring Animal Wellness Center and Sydney. She is a four-year-old husky cattle dog mix. Yeah, apparently a lot of this happens to a lot of dogs. They get stressed out, scared. They can mm -hmm. even injure themselves during thunderstorms. Yeah, I've had dogs go through plate glass windows yeah. and so yeah, that's not a good thing. So how do you, how do you calm Sydney and, and dogs that they get really freaked out by this? So uh, the very first thing that you want <laughs> to do is to escape right now. <laughs> closest to her mother that way. Um, the very first thing to keep in mind is that it's although it's your instinct to console them, when you do that, there's the risk that they could interpret that as praise. Um, uh. So if you're if you have a dog that's panicking during a thunderstorm, you you actually don't want to pet them and show them that's a lot difficult. of affection. I know it's I know it is. Yeah. But you basically just want to stay very neutral and stay very calm. Distract them if you're able to. With um, a toy or a with treat a toy. or something. Yeah, uh, a treat's rewarding. Yeah, you don't want to do okay. a treat. Treat would be rewarding. But probably the biggest thing is if you have a dog that's just kind of beyond being distracted is to provide them a safe place to go, which could be a basement, could be a bathroom, could be their crate if they're crate trained and comfortable in their crate. Um, and just kind of allow them to hide out and stay there and just not try to pull them out, not try to engage them overly, just let them hide out. Do you want to slip your dog maybe half a Benadryl or something <laughs> in a situation like that? Um, you want to talk to your vet before doing anything like that, but there are definitely uh, medications that we can use if the anxiety is extreme enough. Um, we will sometimes use Xanax, Valium in dogs, and that's something that you can give a couple hours before you know the storm is going to hit, so by the time it gets there, they're hopefully nice and relaxed. Um, there also are also our products, like th um, one brand is a Thunder shirt, but there are many other brands out there that are basically compression wraps, so they look like mm. t-shirts that are very tight around their torso, and we don't know exactly how they work, but dogs seem to like that effect of just being hugged by something and so putting one of those on and in some dogs it does not help at all in some dogs it really does make a huge difference so it's worth a worth try, a try yeah. absolutely all right. dr katie heinrich thank you so much and I thank you to sydney sydney has said she's had enough got a Great. question for our experts <laughs> so email them done. <laughs> ask the expert today's tmj4.com you can leave a voicemail at that number on your screen coming up next we'll talk about lint rollers